from Andrew Jones. First major league hit. Line drive, run scoring, single into left field. So Jones getting a little better with each at bat. Comes up here in the ninth inning. Runners first and third. Jumps on Borland's first pitch for a run scoring single to left. He's talking to Giovanni Vicies, the scout that signed Andrew. He said that country basically comes to a stop just to watch the games on TBS. 1-1 one, one pitch hit high and deep to left field. Back to the wall, Lenny Harris. This ball's out of here. Home run, Andrew Jones. His second homer, and it ties the game at one. That had a little hang time, didn't it? He's one out of two with a homer. He is two out of three with two homers. To a straightaway center field with some altitude and some longitude. And you're going to have to double deck the bandwagon for this youngster. Here's Andrew Jones. Lopez at second with one out. Hit a ton to left. 13 to nothing Atlanta. He told us he was going to do it. Bobby Cox before the game said that Andrew Jones was going to hit a home run tonight. Jones becomes the youngest player to hit a postseason home run 19 years old. It was part of our athletic trivia question the other night. Who was the youngest player ever to hit a home run in postseason play? It was Mickey Mantle in 1952 of course for the Yankees. Long drive in a left field at the track at the wall it is gone. Andrew Jones his second postseason home run and it's two to nothing Braves in the second. Depending on this three two pitch into left field well hit strawberry back at the wall another home run for Andrew Jones a two run homer a three run homer. And all of a sudden, it's eight to nothing Atlanta here in the third. What a performance by the 19 year old. Into right, well hit. Andrew Jones back at the wall. What a catch. Now they have range off first. Double play. Now it's Andrew's turn. Fox sounds of the game. That's how it sounds if you were an outfield wall and a 19 year old stepped into you. I think the mysterious thing here is why didn't Tim Raines run hard going back to second? He almost stopped at second. Now he has to slide to make it close at first base. Get to deep right center field. Andrew Jones. Oh, good night. What a great, great. That's why that man's a gold glover. I mean, that saved three runs. What a tremendous play by Andrew Jones. You're not going to see any other center fielder in baseball make that play. Look at this. Good night. Wow. From sitting at this angle up in the booth and watching out there, I said to myself, there's no way he's going to catch that. And just start watching him close ground and close ground and then dives and makes a tremendous catch. They just do not get any better than this. Look at that. His body parallel to the ground, off the turf, and almost behind him. He has continued to improve every year. He's only 23. Line drive, base hit. 
Here comes Sheffield. That'll make it 3-2. Chipper Jones stops at second. He lines it in the center field for a base hit. Yeah, that's what it is, a hanging breaking ball. And he lines it back in the center field, and he gets an RBI and brings the National League one run closer. Payoff pitch to Bonds. Bonds, it's a high drive in the center field. Jones back, look it up in front of the wall. He leaps, and it is caught. Jones leaped just to the right of the straightaway center field at the 400 mark. And he may have taken a home run away from Bonds. I think he did. I think he went over the wall to get it. Yes, he did. So Bonds will save that one for another day. Got a little cutter on the out, out over the play at the belt. And Andrew Jones went over the yellow line and took one away. That was out of here. The stretch and the pitch. There's a drive deep left field. He's got 50 home runs. Does Andrew Jones into the second deck? What a blast. Wow. A little frustration in that swing on the night's work. But 50 home runs for Andrew Jones. And this crowd applauds him for the 50 and for the length of that blast. It went six or seven rows into the upper deck in left field. That ball was sucked. Only the 23rd player in Major League history to have a 50 home run season. There have been some that have had more than one, but he's only the 23rd different player to do it. One two pitch swung on hit high and deep to center field one Pierre is going to watch this one sail way out of here home run number 51 for Andrew six to one Atlanta. RBI number 127. And no doubt about that one. Juan Pierre barely moved. In the gap to left center. Can Andrew catch up with it? A diving catch in yes. the game! Drew Jones wow. does it again with a tremendous diving grab in the alley in left center field, preserving Tom Glavin's 22nd career shutout. What a catch. Holy, I didn't think he had a prayer, Bob. That ball was ripped in the gap. Look at him. He gets extended as far as he can go. My goodness, backhand. I'll tell you what, that was at least going to be a triple for Cordero, too. Spires cooks at the center. Andrew turns tail, still going at the wall, up the wall. He made the catch. What a play. It's a good thing he caught it, or it would have been called an air. I don't know what. Uh... I don't know what you're supposed to say about this kind of play because you've never seen it before. Into the wall, catch, and then had the presence of mind to come off the wall and make a strong back throw back to first base. Eat your heart out, Willie Mays. Exactly. That's a tougher play than Willie Mays made. Darn tootin'. Six runs in five innings, even though he was hitting 94 miles an hour, and there is a smash to left center field and Andrew Jones is wearing out the Angels. Where was this guy last year? Ooh man, but I don't know, but he's hitting one home run every 14 at bats. If he had enough ABs to qualify, that'd be fourth best in the league. That ball is hammered down the left field line and it is gone. Andrew Jones killing the Angels. See, there's another elevated 94 mile hour fastball. And he hit it a ton. The only question was, was it going to stay fair? 
Hit well left field and back goes Juan Rivera and Andrew Jones had a night to remember. Three home runs. First three homer game in seven years. Who is this guy? Well, there's some angel pitchers that are going to have to learn how to pitch effectively inside, or they're going to keep seeing this coming. Because you know the game is played, and you gotta you gotta be able to get one half of the plate. You know, you just can't keep letting guys get up there and take batting practice off you. Yeah, him, as we have seen from the scouts. There he is. He just looks up. You can put it on the board. Yes, number 400. Number 400 for Andrew Jones. He is now in 46th place all time by himself. Congratulations to one of the great players to ever play this game. The fans giving Andrew a standing ovation, and justifiably so. He got one up in the zone and rode it out of the ballpark. That ball hit high and deep. Stretch. Stretch. Way back. He looks up. You can put it on the board. Yes. Yes. A grand slam by Andrew. And it's a 12-6 Sox lead. Marcy. Andrew Jones with his 19th. He's driven in 46. And there's a slider down in the zone. Our Ford home run replay. And that makes it a lot more comfortable. It's a 12 to 6 game. Comes in hitting at 209. 16 homers, 37 driven in. That ball hit deep. Way back. Span looks up. You can put it on the ball. A three run homer and the Sox lead it three to two. Marcy. Only the third home run given up all year by Liriano. And after a trip to the mound by Anderson. Andrew picked on the first ball fastball. 17 and 40 on the power numbers. Our Ford home run replay. A fastball right down the middle. And this ball gives the Sox the lead. Now the pitch to Andrew swung on and hit in the air to deep left. That ball is high. It is far. It is gone. Andrew Jones hit a skyscraping home run down the left field line. Oh, he's Mary Andrew keeping up with the Joneses. And Andrew hits his second home run of the year, and the Yankees have a 6 3 lead. Well, Maloney is a fly ball pitcher, as the scouts had said, and, and if that's true, he's going to have trouble in American League parks. Pitched his whole career such as it was in the National League. And I'll bet he's going to give him a lot of home runs. And Perkins is readying the 2-2. Swung on a high drive to left. It is high. It is far. It is gone. Now, so Andrew Jones turned around a fastball and hit it in the left center field seats. Mary Andrew keeping up with the Joneses. He homers and the Yankees trail 5-4. And now you know how big the walk was to Revere that set up the base hit by Maurer that gave Minnesota a two-run lead. Hey, them's the breaks. Now here is Jason Nix. So Jones homers. Perkins threw, he actually threw a high breaking ball way up and Jones got on top of it and hit it out. 